humble lifestyle of Tata Group Chairman Ratan Tata. His father was an adopted son. But like his father, Ratan Tata too dealt with troubled childhood. His parents got separated at the age of 10. And he was raised solely by his grandmother. If he wouldn't have rejected or left the job from IBM, then what he is today wouldn't have marked his unconventional journey. Even after he created name, he doesn't believe in power and dominance. He earns a degree in architecture and also holds a degree from Harvard Business School. He loves to drive his Ferrari in his free time and has a wonderful collection of high-end cars including Ferrari California, Cadillac XLR, Land Rover Freelander, Chrysler Sebring, Honda Civic, Mercedes-Benz S-Class, Maserati Quattro Porti, Mercedes-Benz 500 SL, Jaguar F-Type, and Jaguar XFR. He was awarded Padma Vibhushan, Padma Bhushan and Knight's Grand Cross of the British Empire. He owns a pilot's license and flies aircraft of Tata Group. He completed his first solo flight at the age of 17, and now he owns one. He became the first Indian to fly an F-16 fighter jet during an air show. He has acquired Jaguar, Chorus, Land Rover, and Tetley and he made an Indian company turned into a global player. He is the advisory boards of Mitsubishi Corporation, Booz Allen Hamilton, AIG and JP Morgan Chase. Well, nano cars are the dearest project of Ratan Tata, and also his two pet dogs that he takes care of so fondly. He is so selfless that he believes in creating wonders for less privileged one, and his welfare trust has already provided assistance to many people suffering from natural consequences. Though Ratan Tattoo is not included in the list of billionaires because he is an avid philanthropist. He is someone who dreamt of doing big but also believed in doing great for others. His humble lifestyle proved that money doesn't matter but one's nature does. His philanthropist work has proved him that to gain respect and love is to act like one. He neither believes in showcasing his power through money, as he still travels in economy class when it's necessary. That sets a different example which is very unlikely, that even though he is such a big businessman, he never displayed his attitude in mind, but through his gratitude he made the nation fall at his feet. The man never shied away in spending much on relief fund or to the needy. He is visionary who believes in inspiring many that to be great is treat everyone with equality. Address him as the chairman of Tata Group, a social worker or a leader, his lifestyle has only approved due to his humbleness and selfless nature.